Hey, what's up guys? This is Anthony from Anthony's Customs, and for this video, I'm going to show you how to have kind of like unlimited caps in Fallout 4 since the other glitch was patched. So, for this, all you need to do is find a weapon or item that is worth a lot of money. In my case, I'm using the Big Boy because it is the most valuable item I have. It's worth around $5,000 to me. When I sell, it's worth around $2,500. And so what you need to do is kind of duplicate this and you'll be able to sell that as many times as you need to when you're with a merchant to have basically unlimited caps and you can buy whatever they have using all of these duplicated uh, weapons or items. And so how we're going to do that is not a new thing. We're going to use dog meat to pick it up at the same time we pick it up so that we can duplicate it. So all you have to do is drop it on the ground and send dog meat away. And this is the easiest way. You don't have to technically send him away. But when he runs towards you and then stops, it's easier to time the button press. So what you want to do is right before he picks it up, which will be just after he stops moving, you just pick up the item. That's all you have to do. And once you give it a couple tries, you'll be able to time it no problem. And you can do this as many times as you want. Like I said, this isn't a new uh, exploit or glitch, uh, but it is probably going to be the most effective way. At least it is the most effective way that I know to have infinite money in a quick amount of time without spending too much effort. Uh, so for this, I'm just going to do it like four times and I'll have four big boys uh, and then you can just take as many as you want to the merchant and sell them all or trade them all and it'll give you let's say if you have four of them ten thousand dollars ten thousand caps with that merchant at that time which you don't want to do you want to try to optimize this so don't give them too many because that you won't have ten thousand caps worth of things that you want to get from them so uh, I'll cut over to the merchant so you can see that now. But as you can see, it's worth 5,000 caps to us. It's not going to be worth that much at the merchant. So you're going to need more than you think. Uh, I just did this with Trash Can Carla because she was here, and I did it actually before I shot the other part because I didn't want her to leave. Uh, so I only have one big boy for this example. Uh, but all you have to do is click on it so that you're trading it, and that's going to put her in the negative by that much money or that many caps. So in this case, it's going to be around 2,500. And... Most merchants aren't going to have that many things that you actually need to buy, so you don't need to lug around a bunch of these. Or you can even just do it on a, on a per-merchant basis, just run back to your storage area or give it to your companion. Then you can take as many as you need to trade. Uh, in this case, I don't need that many things from her, so I'm just going to go through and check everything quickly. Make sure I don't actually spend too much of my uh, 25000 because it'll just disappear. Because they only have a certain amount of caps, and if you don't spend up to that amount you're going to waste your money. So I'm going to buy up all of the ammo and everything and get it right around 397 caps. That way I get her caps and I haven't wasted anything. So I'll do that and then once I've completed everything, I will just complete the transaction. I'll accept the transaction. I'll lose the big boy that I traded her, but I will have everything I want from her and the extra caps. So there it is. Like I said, it might not be the uh, most efficient way but it's a really effective way to get it done quickly and to not have to spend like a ton of time doing it just spend a couple minutes grab the things you need and you're good to go so there it is guys i hope that helps you uh, if you know a better way let me know uh, i don't know if i'm going to switch from this because i don't need that many things from the merchants but it's a good idea so let me know how it works out for you guys and hopefully this was helpful i'll see you in the next video